Hey guys, welcome to Greg's Beer Reviews. Let's go check out and see what's in the fridge today. Hey guys, thanks for stopping by Greg's Beer Review today. Today's beer is West Bonner Heppy Weiss beer. This is their Heppeweizen, or Heppeweizen, however you want to pronounce it. Uh, this beer is uh, comes from uh, the Browery Stratus. It is Barrick Stratus Brown Westerfan. They're out of freezing or freezing Germany. Uh, this beer comes in at 5.40 ABV. Uh, Yes, what's going on the bottle too? 5.4 ABV. So, this is an ale. The food pairing for this, cuisine, cheeses are tangy, uh, brick, atom, feta, uh, and the meat is poultry, fish, and shellfish for this one, guys. Uh, not recommended for extended cellarings. It's a year-round serving from these guys. So if you can get their beers, uh, you're going to be able to get this one year-round. So, <coughs> let's not cellar it any longer. Let's see what we got. Pointed in the dink like a glass, it calls for the uh, wheezing glass, but this is as close as we're going to get today. And I've already done started pouring it too strong because it's going to have a monster head. This is their wheat beer. Got carried away starting off on that one. Forgot what I was pouring. Didn't want to have a five finger head on this one. That's the right pretty color. It is a not quite to the light straw. It's just a little more amber than than that. And it's right out of the fridge, about 40 degrees. It's frosting up the mug. A lot of bubbles streaming from the bottom of that glass. I mean, it is going crazy in there. So let's get a nose on it. See what it's about. Wow. I mean, it's just like <laughs> you get the bubble gum, banana. Clove. Wow, that smells wonderful. Wow. Uh, the aroma of that is incredible. Wow, wow, wow. I can't wait. Cheers, guys. Wow. A lot of uh, a lot of bananas going on there. A whole lot of bananas going on there. Uh, there is some brady yeast going on. Oh man, that is so pleasant. Got that bubble gummy taste too, boy. It's really sweet. Cloves. Wow, excellent. That is an excellent beer. Uh, the beer, the beer, uh, the beer, th this is the third, third beer in the series that I've done from them, and uh, they've all been, all three of them have been excellent, so guys, uh, now the winner here, three in a row from, uh, from uh, West Stephon. Wow, incredible. It's going to be an A beer, guys. It's right out of the fridge, 40 degrees. I'm going to sip on it. I mean, the carbonation on these beers is just insane out the glass. Incredible. This is a good one, guys. Stick around. I'll be right back. We'll do the final chug. Hi, right, guys. Thanks for sticking around. Got a little left in the glass here. This is an extremely nice beer. Now, I think I told you this was the third one. This is actually the fourth and last one in the series. Uh, uh, we've done all four of them that I picked up. So, final chug, guys. Lots of banana. I mean, the banana is just up in your face. A little bit of clove, maybe a little honey, lemon zest, uh, clove. Very nice. 
very, very nice. I mean, it's an ex exceptional example of the style of beer, which is a hemp bison. So, uh, guys, it's a nine on a scale. Uh, the only thing I can downgrade it for is got a, a batch number or a code on the back without actually having the date on the bottle. So, give me a date, guys, and I'll I'll give you a ten. I swear I will. So, if y'all had that, let me know, guys. Y'all like it, loved it, hated it. Everything that I've drank from them has been a beer. It's been all a beer. So, uh, guys have been doing doing it since 1040. I think they got it down pat. They know what they're doing. It's uh, all been exceptionally good beer. So, uh, Rate Beer has just 99 overall and 100 in the style. So, that's almost perfect. And Beer Act has an A in there, just like I'm going to give it. I'm going to give it a 9 on the scale. Give me a date on the bottle, guys. I'll give you a 10. I swear I will. Rate, comment, subscribe, guys. Give me some feedback on this one. And see you tomorrow.